Hey guys and girls, this is Gordon Overkill, playing Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup, second streak game. So we're going for a streak of three with Delvas, and this is the third episode. We have so far cleared the first ten dungeon levels, as well as the Lair of Beasts. We let... Lord will live on D10, and we probably let him live a little longer, because it's really dangerous for us. Still, we will try to clear the rest of the dungeon in today's episode, and maybe also the Orcish Mines. It's not too unlikely. So, let's see what we can do here on D11. I always have to force myself not to kill strong enemies immediately. Although I play, I play roguelikes for a long time, and I know that's how you lose your games when you take risky fights. It's still pretty tough for me to do what I know must be done. Um, where did we last see Lodo? Down here, so we can pick up this scroll, I think. Maybe take a look around here at this spell book. Yes, got it. And from here on, let's go back down. We will come back to D10. What ring do we have here? Magical power. I don't think we need magical power. We do have... Poison resistance and fire resistance. And we've got one pit of willpower by now, so it's a little bit. You hear the thunderous beating of a drum nearby? Oh, Let's see if we can get it. It's already thunderous. I kind of didn't realize. Oh, here is the gauntlet, and we go in there. Let's see if we can do the gauntlet. What do we have here? Down there, I see a wrath moth with spiders. That's doable. Over here is mutation stuff. That's doable. The right gauntlet is definitely doable. The left gauntlet, that's mainly melee. That's absolutely doable. We can probably do it all. Yeah. I think let's make it depend. On the loot. There's enchant weapon, I like that. And a ring, a magical cape, and a potion. That looks really nice. I tend towards the right gauntlet, I think. Here is magical gloves, but we do already have artifact gloves, so we don't really need that. Then a potion and a scarf, but we do already have a plus two cloak. I think let's go for the right gauntlet. It's a little easier. Also, we don't need cold resistance and so. Which enemy do we have here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's go up here. He confused us. Oh, fuck. Let's do that here in the corner. Cure the confusion. And kill the Eye of Devastation. He can devastate us. Yeah, that's, that's damage. Kill. Come on, hit it. It tried to devastate us. We, it's very hard to hit. We got confused. Let's cure again. And now we got it. Where's the confusing eye? Here. On its own, it's not dangerous. It takes a while till we're not confused and can kill it, but uh, it's just a matter of time now. It cannot damage us. Also, that's a haste potion. That's really nice. Did we get it? Yes. So, haste potion from the first. Let's continue. We tasted, uh, we exchanged a haste potion for two uh, potions of uh, of curing. I think that's absolutely worth. Okay. Again, what can you do? Just lay damage. Let's fight. Get heroism on. Good, got him. These chaos spawns relatively easy. He can mutate us, but we've got a couple mutation pots. Oh, he's he's asleep. Why did he fall asleep? Feel asleep? 
I think it chaos itself. Perfect. Let's keep enchanting our evening star. And identify this scroll, which is summoning. We are not allowed to use that, sadly. Very strong, a strong scroll, but we are a devoted follower of Okawaru, so we cannot use it. Um, we might want to drink Invis in there. Quickly kill Rathmog before somebody starts. Come on, kill it. Yes, got it. Good. Okay, maybe we don't have to drink Invis. That was very good. Let's go for the for the rings. Was there another wrath mod somewhere? I just see the spider at the moment. Yeah, it was just this one wrath mod. Nice. Intelligence ring, unknown potion, and plus one cloak of poison resistance. That means we could use another ring. Do we have a ring that we want to use at the moment? Protection from fire, sea inverse, this is corrosion. Not at the moment, but we will we will probably swap to that later. Now we have to kill a Minotaur. Where is the Minotaur? It already opened the door. We do have inverse, we do have might in case we need it. We do have light to blind it, that's very good. We do have Blink as an emergency escape. We definitely want to buff up. And now let's go in here. It's armed with an Alabest. That's nice. <laughs> Shoot me if you want. Plus, plus two plate armor of willpower. That's good armor. Now it wields uh, Stuff of Conjuration. Easy. That was uh, very unlucky equipment for the Minotaur this time. Let's pick up... Let's pick the Alabest and also the armor. It's penetrating Alabest. That's actually pretty nice. Plus four. Definitely not bad. What do we have here? Heal wounds. Identify. And the condenser vein. That's nice. We, can, we have to drop some stuff. The ordinary Alabest. Um... um I don't think... Wait. Where do we get sea invis from at the moment? From the armor. We keep the ring for now. Ice ring we need. Intelligence. I think we can drop that. We don't need a ring of intelligence. Poison we can drop. Mm, noise we can drop. Torment we can drop. Summoning we can drop. Yeah, I think that's fine. And now... Pick up paralysis, identify condenser vein. Anything we missed? Nope. Ah, this time this was a pretty good gauntlet. Definitely worth going in there. Take a short look around here. It's a bee. Hello, bee. Come over here. Kill this B as well. Two Bs. Got them all. Good. Scout a little bit around here. Can we kill the Yaks as well? Oh, just one Yak comes. Okay, fine. And another haste potion. Nice. Oh, we lost our boomerang. That's sad. Third, 34 armor. It's hard for them to hit us. Get 
couple spell books. Let's see what spells we will use later. <clears throat> the crystal plate, let's drop that for now. Um, we could maybe pick that up later and enchant it if we want to. The cold resistance leather armor we'll probably not use too. Did I forget to... Ah, I forgot to pick up the, the the plate armor of willpower. Shit. Yeah, I left it in the gauntlet. Idiot me, I wanted that for orcs. I probably didn't have space in the inventory. Ah, damn, that's annoying. Actually, there were a lot of really avoidable mistakes in this run already. The miss uh, level ups, uh, mechanical mistakes, and now not picking up the armor that I wanted. Ouch. But we've got 30. Okay, still strong enough. Good. Enchant weapon. Let's keep enchanting the evening star. This is probably our weapon for the whole game. There I saw a treasure trove, I think. Didn't I? Yes, let's check that. Plus seven demon whip. We need to open it. Plus seven demon whip. So if we get a demon whip with nice enchantment, we can think about that. That was an Alec leather armor. But plus zero leather armor. Nope, don't think so. Silver javelins, nice. We do have RF up still. Let's. Yeah. Was worth using heroism. Okay, we don't have our cold. We need our cold for this fight. Equip the ring of ice rather than poison resistance. We still got heroism up. Let's see how the fight goes. Yeah, we be we beat him. Perfect. Fuck. Um. Fear. That was too much damage. He comes from behind. Let's blind him. Good. That should allow us to outrun him. And I kill this guy. Good. Regenerate. Let's go for the the big guy first. There he is. Let's cure him. That should do the job. Nice, got him. Heal wounds. Oh, all the level level nine spells from the uh, Book of Annihilations. Let's swap back to the ring of poison resistance. Yes. Don't we have it from something else? Nope, we don't. So, and we're done on this level. Spend a few consumables, nothing too bad, and got some nice, very desirable items. Teleportation. Finally, we have teleportation on D13. Let's also identify these potions. That's attraction. That's cancellation. Nice. That's ambrosia. Attraction we can drop. Let's 
let's make sure that we don't pick up stuff that we don't need. Dex ring, one evasion ring is enough, the end ring, don't need another ice ring, magical power, wizardry, also we don't need polymorph. Poison, Dormant, we don't need Attraction, I think that's it from now, yeah. We're on D13, let's see what we find here. Come on Death Knight, let's fight. Heroism, poison him as good as we can and fight. Got him, nice. Kill them, good. Was a good start. What do we have here? Two Death Knights, Afrid, Cain Toad. But there's a lot of loot in there. Whew, probably not now, but we will come back there. I mean, of magic region, we don't need. This is Potion of Magic, Hello Elves. Can we somehow lure them out? Or do we want to fly over there? Enlightenment, yeah, let's do that. Here we come. Come on, kill him. Got him, good. And now let's finally get some points in strength. Can we kill him? He stands in the water. Perfect. Let's flame him. Oh, well. They're confused. Damn. They're slowed. Not nice. Let's condenser vein. And maximum buff up, so we can still attack fast. And let's take our javelins, soften them up. Hope we can kill the yeah, we get the ogre, perfect. Nice. Excellent. Plus eight orc bow of draining and stealth. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Let's javelin him too. Nice and we killed him. Ah, these javelins are deadly weapons. With a skill of fifteen when we're buffed up. But we lost a couple of them. We've got three left. He's dead. Good. He's dead. And he's dead as well. What did they protect in here? Kill him. Oh, fuck. It's a little... Tough. I don't want to take a big risk here. It's a plus one heavy grade mace. Let's kill him as quickly as we can. And we get silver javelins too. Not bad. Also, the entrance to the lair is now secured.
Come on, you cowardly blinker. And we're done with this level. Nicey. Um, broad X of electrocution. <laughs> Boah, it's also nice. nice weapon. Lots of gold. Artifact talisman. There's actually not that much really useful in this vault. Let's not go in there. Rather go down to D14. Kill a couple of horses. Nothing to identify at the moment. We got marked. Okay, let's. Getting marked on a level that's completely unscouted. That's not so nice. Let's use a lot of heroism for these fights. So we fight with 15. Mace scale and also 15 shields. Okay, let's slowly try to kill everybody on the inside of the room first. Hope he doesn't. Okay, that worked. Killed the beetle, perfect. We are a little low on HP already. Let's throw a couple of javelins in there. Heroism up again. It's another beetle. Beetle down. Fuck. Blind them. Doesn't work. At least it does damage. Can we just. Oh, fuck. It's too much damage we take here. Ouch. Kill them. Got, got them. Beetle is blinded too. I like that. Let's. Anyways, let's. Condenser vein. And lightning. Now we're too low. Let's heal wounds. That was costly, but we won. Pick up the ordinary javelins. And we already killed a couple of strong enemies from this level. That's definitely a plus. Let's check this upstairs. Another enchant armor. Like it. And done with this level. Anything we could enchant? The boots maybe? But nope. Not at the moment. D15. Here we go. Okay, they do damage, the cyan things. Come on, yeah, luckily he changed his color. Now he changed the back, that's not so lucky. Got them. File of Floods, might buy that later. Revelation, might buy that later. Mutation, might buy that later. The rest is not interesting. Spellbooks. I, I think we got a lot of spells already. A lot of skills went up to nine. Got 
let's see. Ooh, we don't have a cold. Put, put on the ring of cold, ring of ice. Whew, shit. And now blind them. Good. And throw a javelin at the last one. Good. Oh man, we don't have our cold. Keep that in mind. Mr. Overkill. Plus zero, fuck. It's a crystal plate, a armor of strength and RF. Why must it be plus zero? If that was a higher enchantment, I would have loved it. Ah, shit. What hat was that? Just an ordinary plus two hat. It's the same that we're already wearing. Nice. Kill the Death Knight. Check the hatch. And we're done with D15, guys. That means Ordinary Dungeon is completely cleared. I'd still like to take a look into orcs, but it's dangerous with willpower one. We don't have anything to improve that. Let's try to play it safe. Maybe we are lucky and get the orc layout with mostly ogres. This, that looks pretty ogre-y at least. Orc sorcerers are now really dangerous for us. If we see them, we must be really, 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 really careful. City and bad. It's annoying, but at least it doesn't damage us. It took quite a while to kill it, though. Who do we have here? Uh, the strongest guy is Nightfall the Severer, a journeyman Minotaur fighter of Kazlal. I'd like to take a look in there. Let's, yeah, we fight here. And let's travel in them. Need to. Oh yeah, got got them both. Perfect. Behind him is this Minotaur fighter. Here he comes. Now we finesse for this fight and kill him. Got him. Perfect. Traded piety for gold and a shop. They sell cancellation. Nice. Enlightenment. Nice. Mutation. Nice. Unknown scroll. Interesting. Unknown wand and light. That's a lot of nice stuff here. Let's buy the unknown scroll now. And identify it. It's exp po 
potions of experience got just got uh, identified. Let's drink them. Okay, everything up to 11. And another one. Nice. Got some experience. Get into an armor here. Let's identify the scroll on the ground. That's silence. Finally got silence. Nice. Let's check what we have not identified. No. Unrecognized. Um, num, num. Scroll of brand weapon. Burst of creation resilience. Uh, resistance. They are both useful, so I don't want to blindly use them. Brand weapon is the only unknown scroll we know. Mind burst is the only unknown wand. That actually means if Mind Burst is the only unknown wand, that one thesis that I had a while ago when playing the Jin Delver is actually true. Not all wands can be found in a single game. We have these six different wands, and the only other one that's still available in this particular run is the Wand of Mind Burst. So every run, apparently, has just seven randomly chosen kinds of wands. Very interesting. I, I really didn't know that. Now it's proved. Go and pick up the boomerangs. Oh, is the inventory full? Yeah, it is full. Need to drop some stuff. We, we can drop the uh, poison darts. They are pretty useless. Mm, acrobat amulet we can drop as well. Polymorph we can drop. Yeah. And then pick up the boomerangs. Good. And down to Orc 2. Wave of Frost. We want that. Maybe it has something really nice like a... Like a... Let's, let's even le read Revelation to find it. Where is it? On the very other side. Where are the down upstairs? Here, 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 and here. Okay, there is not really a, a much better upstairs. Smote us once. Oh, that's the Orc Sorcerer I was afraid of. Chance of Paradise, 35% is Drink Enlightenment for this fight. Read Fog, go up to the stairs. Take him up with it. Oh, he didn't follow us. Oh, we got the Sorcerer, perfect. Whew. Now I feel better. I don't want to have to sorcerer around. He can instantly, with uh, the right enemies surrounding us, he can kill us in a single turn uh, without us having any chance to react. Block ruler should not be a problem for this guy, for us. Oh yeah. Come on, kill the bats. Got him. Block ruler down. Him. Long sword of holy wrath, but it's just plus one in the long sword. We'll probably not be able to reach the uh, ice cave, I think, if it's even still there. Because it's at the other side, completely other side of the level, and there is no downstairs that brings us closer. Oh, fuck. Go upstairs, good. There was another sorcerer. Don't want to stay close to him. Okay, 
he must have been my dad. Wait for Frost passes over. Still, kill the sorcerer. Good. We somehow need to get through here, but we need to go to the very center of the Orcish army. Get the sorcerer. Good. Okay, we take some damage here. Take him up with us. Kill him. Yep, yeah, we'll not do it in time. Not too bad. He has a plus three dire flail. That's pretty deadly. So let's quickly kill the the Vark and then the Orc. Loud crackling. Yeah. Let's see if we get through now. Oh, it's still too many. Don't want to just rush into the middle of the orcs. Run, 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 run. Oh no, it's already closed. Too bad. Tried it, but we were too slow. Anyways, what do we have here? The Hood of the Assassin. Detect, Step and Stealth. I don't think we need that. Nope. We have an AC Dex Ring. Not bad, but not overwhelming. Don't really need it either. We have Teleportation and Enlightenment. Could as well buy both of them. And here is just weapons that we don't need. Okay, the uh, loot was a little bit underwhelming. Let's buy this indictment, buy a Tally, and buy the Ice Wands. Immolate, we have enough, I think. Yeah, four Immolates, we don't need more. It was a bit bad luck that we couldn't reach the ice cave. C B E G H. So that must be our final wand. Wand of Mind Burst. Yes, that's it. And I think with this being done, yeah, let's call it a day. We do have dungeon and orcs cleared. We have resistance now? Nope. So in the next episode, we will go for our first rune. From snake or swamp. I think we are not perfectly equipped for either of them. Our resistances look relatively poor. We have damage. We have the general AC and EV that we need. I think we will go to snake next episode. But until then, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope to see you all again next time. Until then, bye everybody.